11 mannequins in intricate costumes located right here in front of Salon Pizzazz for both family night and tonight on boat night with the purpose of helping one lucky local nonprofit. It started 12 years ago when we were, I got a phone call that says we want to put you in jail and bail and I don't like to call people and ask for money at all. So instead, during boat week, we threw some kids in the window with numbers on and let people vote with cash so I had enough money to get out of jail. We did that for muscular dystrophy and it just kind of grew and evolved from there. Basically it is a fundraiser for one of our local nonprofits. Now we don't know which local nonprofit is going to win. All of our mannequins are assigned a local nonprofit and people come by and they vote with cash for their Nonprofit, their favorite nonprofit or their favorite mannequin. So in year one, we look back at pictures and as a staff, we just chuckle because our mannequins kind of looked like, um, I don't know, 80s junior high school dance girls. And um, we look and over the years, things just progressed and the costuming got more and more elaborate. I hired a girl a few years ago and she like raised the bar again and it's crazy. It's completely different than when it first started. All the costume designs are made and thought up from our designers in the salon, our hairstylists. They each get a couple mannequins, one or two mannequins to do and we just let them go. We provide the sounds and entertainment for mannequins making a difference. This is our sixth year doing it. We're super excited. It's a wonderful opportunity to help the local nonprofits get the word out. And we have an amazing time every year. We love Kelly Stroko. She's our gal, we've known her forever, and uh, anything Kelly needs, we're gonna do. It's a great opportunity to work with her, work with her amazing stylist at the salon, and really help provide a great show for the community. This year, we've changed things up a bit and had voting available on Venmo for people that cannot come down to the event. But basically what happens is, once the event's over, we count up all the money. The mannequin that has raised the most amount of money over the two days, everything that we've raised for the weekend goes to that particular nonprofit. So we have no idea who's going to win until it's all over with. And we've decided that once a nonprofit has won, we'll take them out of the mix and then that allows other nonprofits to be able to win. Over $20,000 has been raised over the years of doing this event. All of the money going to local nonprofits right here in the Blue Water area. And the good news is you can still make your donations on Venmo until race day, Saturday morning at 8 a.m. That is the cutoff. For the details, go to Salon Pizzazz Facebook. For EBW TV, I'm Annie Naraki.